Welcome back. Another exciting episode of Glenn and the Boys. Let's see what exciting mischief we get up to today. Well, it may not be mischief per se. Uh, he's really on a humanitarian mission to help out the cons, or at least the refugees here at Bitter Springs. Let's see what we can get up to. Let's see you in the game. Some kind of ghost in the dust storm, boys. Be wary. We ain't never fought ghosts before. Hey there. Yeah, he's unique. That's for sure. Now, this would be a useful building if they hadn't locked the door. Maybe they wouldn't need to sleep in tents. Minor NCR presence looks like. Seems to be a bigger tan up the hill. Hello. Hey there. Wow. Hey, it's you. What are you doing in Bitter Springs? You know me. Ain't that not? Yes. Uh, my reputation precedes me, I suppose. And it is true. Everything you've heard, except for maybe the bad stuff. All the good stuff, absolutely true. Hey, uh, while I'm here, you got some right away to spare. Well, one thing we do have is a good supply of right away. Sure, I can help you with that. Excellent. Pay your caps, go ahead and do it. Just stand still and try to ignore the team. Appreciate that. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Hey, you need help with any of the sick here? Just now. Hey. Hey, again. Appear to be the only bed, not on. Captain, I noticed because of the, the raid. Hey there. I've been sending requests for relief for months now. Didn't think they'd send you though. Everybody here in this camp knows me, huh? <laughs> oh well, you should. But why is that flag upside down? It's a distress call. This camp is in bad shape. And <laughs> Can you imagine? I see you. Well, see ya. <laughs> what can I do to hell? At this point, I'll take anything you can give me. We need more troops, fresh supplies, and medical relief. As if that wasn't enough, someone's been coming out of the mountains at night, stealing supplies and picking off my people. What's all this about? Someone popping in and killing refugees? It started about six months ago. First it was just supplies going missing. We figured it was refugees. Then people started dying. Always a single bullet to the head. Always from extreme range. We've lost eight refugees and three soldiers to this son of a bitch. We know he must be hiding out in one of the caves up in the mountains. But I don't have enough men to send out looking for him.
tell you what. Seems simple enough. I can help out. I'll be back. Okay, but make it quick. I'm very busy here. I'll be back with some results, I assure you. Bitches like that. Yeah. Ain't got no tact, I tell you. Bugs. I don't need to tell you I hate bugs. Fireball! Well, shit. Uh, try again. <laughs> try again. Fireball! Take that! Damn it. That. This is heavily irradiated. Not that heavy. Listen, y'all, I need to get this and meat. You don't understand. I got a craving that only ant meat will fill. Mm hmm. Oh, here we go. Bye, cash. Well, I'm sure that'll be useful. Get out of here before we start glowing. Throwing extra fingers and Sell the food cheap, charge a shitload for the rat away. make a funny sound when it come off. I don't like it. Ugh. Easy enough lock to pick. I can pick these ones in my sleep at this point. For supply cash. Drugs. Oh, I see. I believe these are on paintings. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm not sure, but. Cash will be happy about that. Now 
Now, Night Stalkers ain't too good about using guns, from my recollection. So I doubt this is the culprit. But still. Removing some predators from the situation. Always a good thing. Let's go. Oh. Where it ends. More caves off in the distance, looks like. Y'all, uh, make your way around. Don't, and uh, don't die, please. Please don't die. Uh -oh. Is that some sort of advanced gecko? Good job for a sniper rifle. Hey there, Todd. How you snuck up on me wearing that big old suit uh, sort of terrifies me, I'll be honest. Something still watching me. It don't sit right. Where are them other two? Well, hopefully they're okay. Got us another cave system. It's hard to climb to. Maybe that's by intent. Oh, there is a walkway. <laughs> I don't do things like a normie. Speaking of. Rat tactics.
slippery one, all right. Probably set up mines, but be careful. Yep, there they are. There he is. Simple matter. Sure, they won't be happy me taking out one of their own, but. You know what, just to be. Oh, hey, guys. Be super cautious. That's why you don't lay them all next to each other. Amateur. Bunch of food. Seems like he was prepared to camp out here another week or so. Maybe longer. Anyway, he seems to be a key to a supply of cash. I'll find it in here. You do that or huh. well oh, oh, oh that could have been real bad all right I ain't risking it won't take the easy track back You ever do that thing where you're like, you're playing passive events in your head, and you're like, ah, fuck. In baseball, if someone fucks up real bad, they call him a goat. If a goat fucks up real bad, what do you call him? You can't call him a goat, that's not an insult, it's a fact. I think you'll be happy to <clears throat> I said I think you'll be happy to hear some things I will you zonked we might as well take a bed boys good day clear Today's skies is tomorrow's norm so we're not freaks on the room we're just ahead of the curve. Through that. Hey. You'll be pleased to hear some things. You're back. Any progress on saving our skins? I found these supply caches up in the caves in the mountain. I'm pretty sure they're gonna help. Where did you get this? You know what? It doesn't even matter. Thank you. This will be a tremendous help. I've also dealt with the attacks on the camp. It won't be a problem anymore. You did? Who was it? Any information you could give me would be a big help for my reports. It was another great con. He had a base camp in the cave up in the mountains. Really? Well, this canyon used to be a great con stronghold. I suppose that explains why he was able to evade us so easily. Any idea why Great Con would be so far from Red Rock? About three years ago, NCR's first recon launched an attack on the Con encampment here. 
there was a communication mix-up that resulted in some non-combatants being killed. I guess he was still bitter about it. It was a tragic mistake, but we've done all we can to make amends. What have you done? Looks to me like the NCR ran the cons out of Bitter Springs altogether. We provided medical aid to the wounded, all the wounded, and permitted the cons to resettle at Red Rock Canyon. Well, taken care of now. He's in the dust. I'm glad it's taken care of, but still, I wish it could have been resolved without violence. There's too much bad blood there already. I do have another set of supplies, but they're irradiated. However, all you would need to do is filter them with Radex, and it should be safe. We do have some spare Radex in the supply tent. That might work. Thank you. Anything else I can do to help? At this point, I'll take anything you can give me. We need more troops, fresh supplies, and medical relief. Where would I go and get new troops from? I don't know. The NCR's stretched thin as it is. I've put in requests at Camp Golf, Forlorn Hope, McCarran, but things are no better there. Maybe if their situations improved, they'd have men to spare. Or maybe they'd listen to someone with a reputation for helping the NCR. What kind of supplies do you need? Food, blankets, clothes, tools. The Army used to ship out caches of supplies regularly. But with the Legion so active, we haven't gotten any in months. I see. What do you need help with as far as medical supplies? You'll want to talk to Lieutenant Markland about that. He's our medical officer. He should be down at the medical tent now. I'll go pay him a visit. Let's talk about something else. Okay, but make it quick. I'm very busy here. But what is this big old place? This is the Bitter Springs refugee camp. We've been maintaining it for a few years now, ever since Caesar's Legion started seriously pushing west. Most of the people here were displaced by the Legion's advance. At first, there weren't many. But lately, it's been more than we can handle. Why wow, are there so many Great Khan tags around the camp? This whole area used to be a Great Khan encampment before they relocated to Red Rock Canyon. We just haven't had the manpower to clean it all up yet. I see. Well, I'll go pay the doc a visit. Thank you. Good luck. What's up, Doc? Hey. Yeah? What is it? The captain said I should talk to you about lending medical aid to the camp. Hey, if you can help, I'll take whatever I can get. Doctor's bags would be a huge help, but what I really need are medical texts. I'm not trained to deal with major psychological trauma, and we've got a lot of kids in this camp. Medical texts? Who'd you need that? Oh, aren't you already a doctor? I'm an army field medic. I can treat bullet wounds, shrapnel, trench foot, no problem. But this, the kids and the psychological trauma and all the rest, is out of my league. Any idea where I might find these books? Caravan companies are probably your best bet. Smaller traders aren't likely to have anything that esoteric. I suppose I'll keep my eyes open for books. Of that nature, then. Thank you. Any help you can give would be a godsend. I do have this here doctor's bag. Hope it'll be of some help. Are you kidding? The supplies in this are going to save lives. Thank you. That's all. Good luck to you. Stay safe out there.
seems they need a lot more help than I can offer on my own. Any more doctor's bags? Pediatric medicine. Whatever that is. Some sort of psycho book. Morning. Hey there, you got anything to trade? Things are getting stranger every day. Yes, now. Nah. Good luck to you. Legion attacking so far from their bases means we'll have to watch out. Y'all big and chunky. <laughs> I, I get that that's a weird thing to say. All right, just relax. I recall old Blake over at the Crimson Caravan having some sort of textbooks. I don't remember what they say. But let's give that a look first. What's this thing do again? I just swore I've seen this before. Well, I'll take it to the doctor. See what she thinks it does. Nano bionic weed. Flamer fuel. Oh, we good. Did it take note? We need two more doctor's bags. Uh huh. Uh huh. And what? What did he? What did she say? Right, right, right. Psych, psycho, psychological textbook. I think today was productive. We cleaned up a few streets, helped some needy kids, and planted a tree. Oh wait, that was some other guy. Don't worry, I shot him. Hey, Blake. Hey there. You looking to buy or sell? More so, I'm looking for something particular. Hey, you got any, uh, children's psychology textbook? Can do. Hold on, just take a look through your stuff. Huh. Well, look at that. Appears you do. Interesting. And the usual. Any duct tape you got, scrap metal, wonder glue, hey, throw some wrenches in there. Didn't hurt. I'll buy a box of surplus ammo. 
Got anything cool on offer? Grenade machine gun. I still still going wild on that, huh? Oh, I will for sure buy that from you. And two doctor bags. There we go. Hell, I'll buy all of them. Pretty penny, but hey, you earned it. Good on you. See ya. Yep, see ya. Appreciate it. The fiends are running for their lives. Hey there, Doc. You're back. Do you need medical attention? Actually, I wanted you to take a look at this implant I found. Very well. Huh. Regeneration. Now... Yeah, you know what? I suppose having my arm regenerate could be useful. Also, oh, then. Bit itchy. Is that normal? All right, then. All right, looks like we found what we needed. In one simple stop, too. If that ain't a mark of excellence for the Crimson Caravan, I don't know what it is. Make sure I got everything. Yep. Looking like it. all these notice boards say camp regulations curfew is sundown no squatting within view of the camp what do you mean squatting they say the fiends are defeated by doing a deuce close to the army just in case keep your food water and pits away from camp supplies no mixing claimants seeking property can bring quartermaster details 
and a witness. Triage, tri triage decision appeals no longer accepted. No firearms. Well, good thing I ain't. Gotta follow them rules. Things are getting stranger every day. All right, Doc. Got your supplies. Yeah? What is it? Here are your doctor's bags. These will be a big help. Thanks. Also, I found them books you wanted. Both of them? Wow, that's very resourceful. Thank you. I think that should just about cover us. I really don't know how to thank you. You're bringing me these supplies saved a lot of people. Don't sweat it. I was glad to help. It's what I'm here for. Well, still, thanks again. All right. What was that last thing we were meant to do? Oh, yeah. I'm supposed to talk to somebody about getting troops in. Fucking hate these things. Burn, you freak. Every one of them freaks we kill. Hey, it's probably 10 or so people. I can't imagine. Oh, we're off in the distance. Look like. So we ought to go to some of these NCR camps. Suppose we go to McCarran first and then take a walk. Oops. Ever been to the shore? Strange things wash up from time to time. Sorry about that. Most of that shit is. Ooh, with all that gecko meat. Make ourselves some fresh gecko steak. Fine. Something about it, it's got a natural spice to it.
Imagine we'll talk to Shu or Boyd. Didn't mean to speak to Boyd about that water situation. Something I can do for you? Oh, yeah. Yes, what is it? The captain over at Bitter Springs need reinforcements. Think you could spare any? Well, you have been a great help here, and with the saboteur dealt with. Yes, I think we can spare a few men. Consider it done. Excellent. How are things going for the NCR around here? Could be better, I'll say that much. We set up here with our sights set on annexing New Vegas. It's a lot of resources that could do a lot of good for us. But that hasn't happened. If anything, they annexed us. They rake in the profits from our soldiers, and we're stuck protecting them from the Legion. Not exactly the plan. Where does that leave you? Now we're trying to secure the Strip and the Dam at the same time, and it's costing us. And in the meantime, General Oliver won't approve any offensive maneuvers, because he doesn't want to risk losing our positions. So we're in a holding pattern here. And Caesar's on the other side of the river, planning. I see. Well, hope it turns out for you. Bye. Well, there are some troops. You got something to say, or do you always look like that? Oh, I always look like this, but I also got something to say. You're back. Never mind. Yep. See you around. What you watching? You okay? This is your this is your favorite show. I'll leave you to it then. It's gonna be a hell of a walk. Gonna need to make our way over to Camp Golf, which is, I think, to the east a bit. Actually, that Camp Forlorn Hope. Hey. My pit boy said it was near Novak, so let's make a stop over there. We haven't been in a while. Between you and me, it's a little bit of a selfish desire. I've been wanting to sleep on a real bed for quite a while. And it just so happens I own one here. More ghouls, huh? Sometimes I like to repeat myself. That's no accident. Oh yeah, home sweet home. Something about this place. Just brings me back. Bright and early. Bright and early. Get this day started. Forlorn hope ain't gonna walk away. Hmm. 
morning to you. Some cons got cornered in the ruins of Boulder City, but the NCR let them go. That's unusual. Yeah, ain't it? Hey there. Need anything? That I do. Sure. Here's what I've got. I always use some duct tape. Y'all got tons of mini nukes. What's up with that? I'll take some water off you. Appreciate it. Get around. Seeing corpses out in the wasteland ain't too weird, but it's strange. It's strange the way they were placed. And it's like they were just chatting and got taken the hell out. Got here. We got Cazadores. That's what. Oh, you're gonna die painful? Damn it, Todd. You know what? You take care of it. Always running right in. Give me stem packs and any other drugs you got. Where are you at? Damn it, Todd. Uh... Ooh, what do we got here? That's nice. That's something special right there. Mayor's leg. You're fine. Maybe all them drugs you done. Gave you some resilience. Is this place anyhow? For a workshop. Well, we got time to dawdle. Keep your eyes and ears out for more wasteland critters. Damn it, Todd, did you get licked again? Looks like we hit him where it hurts. Right in the dick.
bounty hunter once told me there's two things you can't escape death and taxes. That's why he's always asked for receipts. Because when you kill for a living, the bullets are tax deductible. It appears we took an odd way in. Careful now. That's Todd. Todd? Oh, no. Huh. Close me around here somewhere. Major. A lot with. I'm glad to see you here. We could definitely use your help. Oh, you know about me too. Well. Word of my deeds is spread far and wide, I guess. So, the reason why I'm here is the captain over at Bitter Springs needs some help. In the form of reinforcements, think you can spare any? I'll be honest. The Legion has me worried here, but I think I can spare some soldiers. Consider your request granted. And in return, I suppose I could offer you some help. What do you, what do you need help with? I've got the Legion at Nelson breathing down my neck and not enough men or supplies to get this camp into fighting shape so we can strike back. I need someone to talk to a few of the officers and help them resolve some of the problems around here. If I can get this place in order, then I can focus our efforts on taking back Nelson from the Legion. And the more that gets done around here, the more resources I'll be able to put into assaulting Nelson. Sure, I can do that for you. Good. Let's not waste time then. Our biggest problems right now are supplies and troops, and the Legion is draining us both. Quartermaster Mays has been complaining to me non-stop about the lack of supplies. But unfortunately, we aren't getting a resupply anytime soon. I want you to speak with him and see if there's anything you can do for him. That I'll do, that I'll do. Hey, I saw y'all Camp McCarran. <laughs> Good seeing you. Howdy. Name Sterling, first recon. Can't say I've seen you before. I'd remember if I had. Oh, well. You must be getting old, because I've seen you. You remember everyone who passes through here? Got a good memory for faces. Landmarks and such, too. Comes with practice, that's uh -huh. all. And a lot of scouting from place to place. Interesting rifle you got there. Lever action, right? I call her the Long Carabine. No, you Didn't don't. I always have the scope. I added that myself. You don't Been say that every with time. Her so long, couldn't bring myself to toss her away. Would have felt guilty to part with the old girl. The other snipers used bolt action, but Gorbets reckoned it didn't matter none if I was different, so long as I could hit my targets. Well, uh, it's nice meeting you. Always a pleasure. Keep yourself safe. Is that a Cazador on the end of that one? Hey, damn. Anyway, I call this one Kelly McKeel face. You like it? Well. But we're to talk to the quartermaster. I'm trying to fix things up around here. Hey there, buddy. Nice to see a friendly face around here. We don't get many visitors of your esteem. Something I can do for you? Finally, I am being recognized for my greatness. The Major sent me to help you out. So, the Major has you running errands for him. Well, we're short on personnel as well as supplies, so we'll take all the help we can get. How can I help you with the, the supply problems? The Major let me send out some troops to gather supplies, but unfortunately they never returned. I'm guessing they ran into some trouble on the way. 
You can help by finding the troops and assisting them in bringing back any supplies they found. I see. Any idea where I should start looking? I sent them to Helios 1 to see if they had any supplies they could spare. They gotta be somewhere between here and there. I'd try searching the main road or checking with the men at Helios 1 to see if they know anything. I'll take a look. Thanks. Watch your back out there. Never know when those Legion bastards might show up. Yeah, well, I ain't made an enemy of them yet. Download complete. Begin recording. Navarro Outpost Scientist, I am glad that EDE has reached you. You will find several data banks of information on this machine. Please handle this information with the utmost care, as it represents the sum total of the results of my research on the Duraframe iBots. There are also several data banks with information on my research into Poseidon Energy and some projects they were working on in the Mojave area. Okay. Is that, is that your real name, Eddie? E-D-E? -E? That's what you want me to call you? Oh, you like Eddie, do you? Okay, well, Eddie it is. Eddie it is. All right now. I'm supposed to be tracking down some first recons that can't Supplies. Get on with it. Last known location ain't too far off. Guessing they got trackers on these things. Smart. Real smart. the last of them. I ain't giving you no more stems, Todd. So you've learned. Like See, that's how it's done. Can't even let them get close. Taking us pretty close to uh, Helios. Damn, I'm good. Y'all see that? Holy moly. Scratch my canteen or drink my ass. This is a restricted area. State your business. I was sent here to check on the troopers sent from Camp Forlorn Hope. Hoping that you, uh, hoping, <laughs> hoping that you'd seen them or, or heard them. Yeah, they were here a while ago. Gave them all I could, which wasn't much. But as many problems as we're having here, I know they've got it worse. I've seen soldiers get assigned there. It's like they got told they were going to die. I wouldn't wish it on anybody. If you're trying to track them down, we put a GPS marker in the supply crate. You can track it with your Pip-Boy. Good luck. Say, shouldn't there be more people than this? 
They found in a power plant. There should, but we're not getting much power out of it, so none of our enemies have big interest in it either. Not like Hoover Dam, anyway. We had a real fighting force here just long enough to take it from the Brotherhood of Steel. Then they got sent east to the dam like everybody else. Caesar's Legion sends skirmishers every so often, prodding for weaknesses mostly. The reality is, if they really wanted it, we'd all be dead. Fair enough. Well, I gotta get those supplies, so I'll catch you later. Later. Like I said, GPS tracker. I'm thinking about putting a GPS tracker on you guys. Now that's a good point, Eddie. GPS implies there's some sort of satellite up there. Wonder if there's many of them still working. Ah, shit. Here we go. But I serve the damn infestation. Now, don't judge me. You know how I love my gecko steaks. Oh, damn. They must have... Must have got ambushed by them geckos for saps. Might as well bring their dog tag back. Sell some letters as well. To my dearest Ellen, we're in a tough spot here. None of the men expect to make it out alive. Things look pretty grim. I'm writing this so that if anything happens to me, you know how much you meant to me. I was foolish to join the NCR and leave you behind. And I've regretted it every second of every day. That I've been here. My only wish now was to see you again, hold you in my arms. The only thing that keeps me going are my thoughts of you. Just know that I've made mistakes, but you were the best thing that ever happened to me. I'm sorry, and I love you, Harry. To my brothers, if you're reading this, then I was probably killed by some slime and legion scum who got lucky. Hopefully the bastard is dead and six feet under, but if not, you better revenge me or I will haunt you until the day you die. Quincy. P.S. Kill all the Legion dogs that I wasn't able to. Well. Bunch of hard asses. Bad way to go with the geckos. Though. Now that I think of it, geckos usually just leave a pile of meat behind. Maybe we distracted them or something. Get this plot. Legion. Oh, hell. Uh oh. Caesar's gonna be so mad. What do we got, Eddie? Damn it. 
We done fucked our reputation with the Caesar's Legion. Oh well. Suppose it was gonna happen eventually anyhow. Damn. This is what I mean. You make some friends, you make some enemies. And as he contemplates that, that's where we'll end this episode. Thank you for joining me. I hope you liked it. I sure did. You also got a little bit of lore for Eddie there. Hmm. I'm trying not to look up, because I've, I've never actually finished Eddie's quest. I'm trying not to look up where you get the different pieces of info. So, it's nice stumbling upon it by accident. Anyhow. Thanks for being here. Please like and subscribe and all that jazz if you want to. I'll catch you later.